Now, Kimber want to hear about the boy, how, how he did you at school. I told you about it. You know how to I tell him. But Kimber, he ain't never told him. Yeah, you yes, told me, but, you yes, told I me, did. but I wanted to tell my friends I worked hard. I was all dressed up in the school uniform. Yeah, you was all dressed up because it was test day. Mm -hmm. Looking, I, I know I was looking cute. Because <laughs> I didn't drink with two dry balls that night. I didn't fall or nothing. And you, your mama's right. Hey. My mama needs to go kill. And it was a blood stream. What? This ain't about me, and I don't drink highballs. I don't even know what a highball is. What's a highball? When you mix the Coke with it. I, I oh, like it. Much Coke soda? Yeah, with my Canadian oh, mix. Be quiet. This ain't about me, Maya. I don't drink. Yeah. Tell me your business. I ain't never know. Show sure well, those. I don't know why she time you did, you made you sick. Because I say, Ma uh, Marsha, go. Uh, 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 Shelly, That's sick. Time you the story. Wait a minute. So you was looking good because you had only had two highballs that night before. I might have had more than two now. I ain't gonna lie. Okay. But I didn't fall or nothing. And I and my hair went through. I rolled it up. I was looking. Anyway, it was test day. Mm -hmm. And Barbara Bell, our teacher, she said, Ms. Davis, I hope you we divided the children. It was eight. I had four and she had four. Because uh, the principal, Mr. Levins, and somebody else was, oh, Carol Owens, our supervisor, and somebody else was coming at him. Would you believe this boy <laughs> didn't do nothing? In front of the administrators and everything? Yes. She said, wait a minute, Ms. Davis, you're supposed to. And I told him, I said, what? Come here, come here, come here, man. Over to the side where my desk was. Why did you put this on here? Because I wanted to. I said, hey, you making me look bad. So? And I'm going to get you because you put a zero on my face. I, I didn't put it on there and, I, and they didn't have no choice. You didn't get but three right. It was 24. So I say, motherfucker, is you retarded or something? What the fuck is... I was so mad. I was about to... Because it made you look bad. Make it it, seem it like did. Because you... I didn't have a foot. We divided the two. Oh. What was the, uh, the, what was our uh, uh, system teacher's aide? Teacher's aide. Yes. And four was Bell. Mm. Her did excellent. Mm. Funny bit. Hers was wonderful. I'm sorry. I, 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 I. And he grabbed me. Uh, and, but she had a telephone call. That's what, what happened. And she had to go to office. Miss Davis, I'll be right back. And, uh, Mr. Blevins and uh, Carol Owens and my other super, they had to co have a conference over there. So they just went next door where Beverly and Jackie's sister and her friend was to see what they was going to do. That left me and my four in there. They didn't say a word, but this boy, this silly ass, grabbed me. I said, why did you just take my clothes along? Did you lose your mind? I'm going to beat you. Cause she had no business give me a bad grade. You gave me a zero. A, let go like this. That's what you deserve. I'm gonna get you. I said, well, would you mind me letting me go to the bathroom before you beat my? I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you, Miss Davis. I told you. I told you. No, you ain't told me nothing. Cause I'm the one that told. I even gave you extra candy bar because we was gonna have company and I was kind of showing up with them. No, I'm a beat you. I said, well, turn my blouse loose. You ain't got no business putting your hand. Turn my blouse loose. I ain't gonna turn it loose. I said, how am I gonna use the bathroom with you holding me? Go ahead on. You better hurry up and come. That's why I know his ass was really crazy. You ain't got sense. If he had sense enough to know, if he ever let me out of his sight, I ain't coming back, motherfucker. You dumb bastard. I was, girl, I was gonna go home. And and I could have called Poochie. Poochie said, Mama, you just had a call and I'd have beat the fuck out of him. That other mother. And he would have, at that time, Poochie would have. And would have went to jail. But you don't care about that. What Poochie care about jail? Because your mom, your, your mom told him, I'm glad she didn't call you, Poochie, because you could, I wouldn't talk to you, Mama. I wouldn't talk to you. Carl, you to couldn't him. beat the boy up? Because he had. Okay. But he's 14, but he's bigger than me, Kendall. I, and then, uh, he, how he grab you? 
Huh? And so he grabbed you up by your collar. My, my collar, my clothes. And he said, I'm gonna get you for putting that zero on my paper. Ain't nobody got no zero. Nobody don't deserve it. Zero. I told you two of these. What? I put what I want to put. Leave that alone. Excuse me? And I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna tear your I'm gonna get you good. I said, well, would you mind if I go to the bathroom first? And that's how you knew something was wrong with him because he let you go. No, I, I, I knew for some reason he wouldn't have been in a special ed program in the beginning. But I, like I told his mama, I said, I don't ever. And she was to, mad at you, wasn't she? She got mad. You should have been retired. She said I agree with me. Because this is my mom's principal money then. Her first, she's trying to get a, be a principal. Yeah, yeah. And, and that looked bad on her record for me to complain about one of the students I couldn't handle. Uh-uh, you're supposed to be able to handle any, any situation. And what the but mama you, say? You should have retired. Oh. You have it back. What you say to the mama? I told her I don't I don't want him putting his hand on my clothes. Yeah. I don't want him pushing me around like I'm some kind of child or something. I'm good to him. I give him all kind of candy, pickles, and stuff. You should have his ass for Okay, you could do it. At that time, you could do it. Yeah, yeah but he was big. He was big. Yeah, he was big. He was 14. He and you, and you didn't say nothing back to the mama? I told you, you can't tell me when to retire. Yeah, every year, uh, I heard through the great guy that you, um, every year you come back, you, I ain't coming back, I'm going to retire. And you're the first person we see. Oh. So I'm kidding. You don't know, you don't know, you don't know how bad. I would have pissed you off. Bad. I'm going to make me mad. Huh? I wanted to cry, but I couldn't. Well, how come you ain't say nothing back to her? Baby, with that mouth on you, I know you. You it ain't like you. I, I could have, but, Shelly, I didn't want to lose my job about this place. Oh, okay. I had a lot of good real clothes. My wife, my brother had got me a lot. But I, it's just the idea of him. And I had helped him. I gave him all kind of treats. I was good to him. And for his mom, he do me like that on payday. You ain't no better than I am. Who you think you is? I said, excuse me, I, I try to help your son. He's sweet. He said, oh, yeah, yeah, they tell me anything. Him and my boyfriend, they don't get along. I, and on payday, he want me to give him. I ain't going to give it all my money because I got bills to pay. And he want to give me. But you going to sit up there like you're all last. I didn't say I was all last. But I ain't going to have him pulling on my clothes like that. No, uh-uh. Well, you ain't no better than I am. Oh. He, huh? Oh, I need to cut you off. So how long, I'm trying to say, have you been like just, I know, what, what's the word? You been, you just snapping them in. You been doing it for a long time? My grandma was like that too. She, she say, like me. snap, somebody say something, you just go in. You been like that for a long time? My grandma was like that too. Mm. You wasn't? No. What are you eating, huh? The mom gave me this last night. What is it? What the hell is it? Oh, that's a chocolate thing. I know you're doing it. Jerry, it's my, I'm lying. What is it? Gary, Terry. Gary, spell it out. G, what is it? It's a candy mom gave me last night. That's a chocolate thing. Yeah, and karma. And I put you in the ice box. You know what I'm talking about? Y'all bought them.